Hello everyone. So there was a question on the community today about uh, setting the default values in a field that will disappear when I'll type. Now you can definitely set the default value in Jira for uh, different fields where, where, wherever it is applicable, especially for a text based field. I think it might uh, be useful, but on cloud, you do have few things that are a bit limited. Now let me show you what I mean. So if I click on the create button on top, I may have uh, different fields here. Like for example, you know, I have uh, fields like uh, maybe uh, let us select here uh, number field or there is a field called text field. Now this text field already has some uh, default value because you can set the default value for a custom field. And for doing that, you actually need to go to your uh, custom fields. And if you go to a specific custom field, like uh, maybe you have uh, a text field, which is the case right now. If I try to filter my text field, you can then go to the option here called context, co context and default value. And if you do that, uh, as the name suggests, you can actually create a context for that particular, you know, for, for a specific project or issue type, and then you can set the default value. Now this will work fine, but this default value won't really disappear when the user is going to uh, create the issue. And uh, you can definitely, you know, take a look at uh, the default value here. But again, it is not really going to uh, disappear. However, you can do these things uh, using a behavior on uh, Jira server using script now for Jira. So using script now for Jira, you can actually set the, set the default value. And that is where uh, um, the, the customization aspects of uh, Jira uh, can be, I mean, you can actually do a lot of customizations on server using a uh, script now for Jira or maybe writing your own plugin. But uh, if you're doing, if you're trying to do something like this on cloud, then no, uh, this will not really work natively. Maybe there's an app that can probably do it, but uh, behaviors are not really yet uh, there on cloud. Hopefully behaviors will come on cloud. I hope so, so that you, know, you can add, or we can add dynamic behaviors on the fields. You do have Proforma, which I am hoping to cover because uh, Proforma was uh, acquired by Atlassian. Uh, but setting the default values and making them disappear, I'm not really sure if uh, there is a way of doing it uh, natively uh, without using any app. And I thought I'll probably talk about it and I'll also show you how to set the default value for a custom field in case you are new to Jira. I think this might be something that you are trying to do. So that is all I wanted to talk about today in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.